Hello, Norma. Hello, Mary. Mary, is this your is this your first class? No, it's my second class. The second, okay. You joined on Tuesday, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. No, we... mon Monday. 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 Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hello, Lisa. Hello, teacher. How are you? Good, and you? Uh, yesterday uh, I feel so bad, but today I feel so so. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, not not good, but it's better. Yes. Okay. Mm. A little better. I mm. had a lot of flu. Ah, okay. Yeah. It's difficult then. You have to take medicine and feel better, recover. Yes. Mm. Okay. In the, in the medicine, give me a lot of... No, the medicine made me sleepy. Ah, okay. Yeah, it's strong medicine, it happens. Yes. Okay. Yesterday, our topic was relative clauses. Do you know what are relative clauses? Relative clauses. Mm. Like a cousin. Ah, okay, okay, like a cousin, mm-hmm, no, it's not the idea, but I understand why, mm-hmm, it's not for family. Okay. Mm-hmm, anybody else? Uh, say again, please, it's, I didn't hear well. Join to Okay, to join sentences. Yeah. Okay, good, good. Kind of similar, the idea is really, the idea of relative clauses is to give more information. So when we talk about relative clauses, what we talk about is additional information. Uh, for example, like a description, like an adjective. So when we say, ah, I say, Gerardo, okay. Gerardo what? Gerardo is nice. Nice is an adjective, but relative clauses, Gerardo, who is nice, works in, in Santa Tecla. This is the idea. The relative clause is normally who, what, which, that. Those are the idea of relative clauses. Normally, we use who for people, and we use uh, what for things or which for things. Okay. Yesterday we began and we saw some of this with some exercises. Today we're going to continue because this weekend you have the exam. Did you see in the course that you have the midterm exam? And the midterm yes. exam? Yes. Yes. In the midterm exam, you have the listening, you have the reading, you have the writing, you have a lot of uh, uh, many activities to do in the exam. Yes. Okay. So that's why today we're just, we're going to review a little bit of the class, the information, and make sure that you understand everything uh, that we see in the class. The, uh, the adverbs, the adjectives, the relative clauses. That way, when you do the exam, you do better. You feel that you, you have a better understanding. Okay. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to send you a link so that you can read with your... Hang on. I put in this moment. There. This, this link is so that you can see when do we use which... And when do we use what? Many times people confuse when we use which and when we use what. Okay. Did everybody see 
the which and the what, the link? Yes. yes. Okay, perfect. Then let's read together. Uh, Raul, can you please read the explanation for which? When do you use which and what? Uh, which you have a limited choice of things. Uh, for example, which lemonade do you like? Green or pink? Okay, thank you. Jose Ramos, can you please read the what? Okay, what? Or have a limited choice of things. What lemonade do you like? Hmm. This is the big difference between what and which. When I say which, I give you options or you have selections, you have options. When you have what is all the possibilities, but which is limited. As an example, okay. I say, Mary, which, is, which music do you like? No, it's not correct because which is, is I have to be specific. So to say which, I have to say, mm -hmm. Mary, which music do you like? Rock or, uh, or I don't know, or, or pop? This is which we pop. give. Exactly. Mm -hmm. We give choices. We give options. Mm -hmm. But if I say, what music do you like? You can say ranchera, reggaeton, eh, you can say pop, you can say K-pop, you can say whatever. Okay. Okay. It's okay for everybody, the idea for what and which? Okay. So what we're going to do is, today we're going to begin looking at relative clauses. But specifically, the first activity is we have 10 questions and with the partners, we are going to do is which is correct. Is what or is which? This is the first objective. Okay. Does everybody understand? The first activity is with a partner. We check if it's what or which. Okay. Okay, then let's make our partners and let's answer. Let's see. Let's have, ah, let's have groups today. Let's have, ah, there we go, partners. Perfect. Okay. Everybody has the link? What um, is about the use which to do is correct? Is the teacher said the link or something? No, I I. It's in the chat. It's in the chat. In the chat. Mm -hmm. okay. No WhatsApp. No in the WhatsApp, but here in the chat here. Do you see? No, I, I don't, I, I am not because I re, uh, recently intro. Oh, okay. okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, is what or which with question war is called? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. Uh, no, I can't we hear you. Can you. Okay. We can you. Anna, can you hear me? 
Yes. Okay, okay. So yes, you, you and Raul are going to work in answering the 10 questions in the, I sent in the chat. In this chat here, you can click on the link and you have 10 questions to answer with what or which. Okay. 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 Do you have the same question in your screen, Anna? Uh, I need uh, uh, to share your screen, please. You need what? I need to share your Which car is faster? The red one? Red or the blue one? Which? Which? Mm -hmm. Time what? do you usually get up on Sundays? What time? What time? Yes. Usually. Mm -hmm. Use do you prefer orange juice or, or apple juice? Uh, which? Mm -hmm. Page are we on? What page are we on? What? Uh, we just have one link, teacher. That's correct. That is correct. One link, 10 questions, what or which? Yes. It's we okay. Any, any questions? Uh, oh, no. Not uh, the moment, not. Okay, yeah. then you are ready for the next links. Yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah. perfect. In this moment, I send you the next link then. That will you and your partner practice. Okay. okay. The computer. Did you receive? Yes. Okay. So with your partner, you read and make the decision. Norma, Jose, any questions? The meeting for the nine. What is the meeting? What no. is the meeting? Okay. This means in the in the the book or the exercise has many pages, uh, maybe 300, 400. So, I say, what page are you on? Is what page are you working on? What page are you reading? What page are you doing? Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Any other questions? Norma, Jose? Uh, this topic, no. Okay. Jose, do you see the other link that for the next topic? No. I... No, you don't see? No. Okay, let me send again. Norma, do you see the next link for the next topic? Uh, no. no. Okay. Mm -hmm. No problem. I send. That way you continue working in the next topic. Do you have? It's a relative pronoun quiz. Correct. The relative pronouns. That's right. More practice. Mm hmm Okay, perfect. Good. Lisette, Mary, do you have any questions? No. Not the we, we already finished the exercise. Did you click on the next link? No. No? No? Okay. Let me send maybe... There is a problem and I sent, just to be sure, I send again to you. That way you can do the next exercise. Okay. Thank you. 
Did you receive? Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Then you continue okay. with your partner. Mm -hmm. Relative pronouns. I can select it. In Suf. Norma, Anna, are you okay? Hello. Are you? Yes. No, teacher, yes. I'm confused. Only, only, only the first exercise. That or in the second the part two. In the in the second exercise, the second link, the relative pronouns. Do you That's do? Let ah. Me let me check. Okay. The second. Ah, okay. 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 I like it that that your exercise. Okay. The computer. Okay. The computer. Yeah. I will, okay. Correct. Relative the computer. The computer. Pronouns, please. Okay. Yes. 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 Okay. Okay. You continue Relative. with the, the okay. next one. Mm -hmm. The computer I bought last week is a help about that word. Um, yes. I didn't know that whom exists. You didn't know that what exists? Whom. Ah. W H O-M. Yes, it's similar to that, the use for who. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's new for me. Is the difference is that whom is usually very formal. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Whom, formal. Is the same like who? Yes, yeah. yes, yes. It's very similar like who. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, next is the one. Bird. Uh -huh. uh, okay. you, your answer is limited. Uh -huh. That is why you use which. Add. Okay. Mm -hmm. Number seven. Uh, I think it's what. What time do you usually get up on Sundays? Yes, it's a what? Uh -huh. You don't have limits to answer. Okay. Ana no. and Raul, I send you, when you finish, I send the link for the next activity. Okay. Okay? Okay. 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 Sure. Perfect. Okay, number eight. Number eight? It's which again? I Okay. Uh, no, number eight. Which you eight. do you prefer? When you take a I really enjoy the time when you went to the Chinese book. Yeah, it's uh, okay. 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 Don't who was one of American drivers? Okay. Do you have any questions for the relative clauses, the relative pronouns? We first we started with what or which. Remember, what is general, which is selection, which is options. Okay. Then we have the relative clauses with when and who. When is for time, who for people. It's are there any questions in this moment for relative clauses? Not too sure. No question. In this exercise, no we can have that. 
I'm sorry, I didn't hear you well. In which exercise? What? In with who or what? We. Mm -hmm. And we didn't. We didn't have what in this exercise. Yes. In in the in the second exercise, not in the first one. In the second one, not the first one. What is for general ideas? Mm -hmm. So normally is the or normally we use the words who, what, which, or whose mm -hmm. also. Who is for people, which is for yeah. things, for choice, and whose is for possession. For example, the, the cell phone, for the cell phone. Ah, no, whose cell phone is whose cell phone. Mm -hmm. Teacher, Father, please, whose? Whose is for possession, is the ah. owner. Is who whose is for the owner? Mm -hmm. Okay. In this moment, and we're the, mm -hmm. the teacher in the whom with M. Who, yes. Whom yes. is like who? Only that whom is more formal. Uh, is more formal. Yes. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I don't understand the use. Okay, the so is I have the idea for you. Hang on. Let me give you, a, let me type this information and I send to you in this moment in the chat the explanation so that is clear. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm, going, I'm going to read, but you have in the chat also, and then I explain. Whom should be used to refer to the object of a verb or preposition? So it's an easy trick. This is the trick. If you change the who for he or she, then it's who. But if you change for him or her, then it's whom, not who. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. So in the okay. sentence, like I, I, like Manuel, Manuel, I can change for he, or Andrea, I can change for she. So then I can use who. Okay, but if I change for him or for her, then it's necessary I use whom with M. Okay. Okay. Yes. Can you can you give us an example using in in our sentences? Yes, of course. Only we change for who and him. Uh, he, he is the friend whom. Uh, or whom I invited, whom because I don't, uh, we change for him, I, Im I invited him, so instead of saying him, that's who, sorry, whom with M. So whenever you use the idea of him or her, you're going to have many times, the idea is going to be with whom. I, I'm going to write because I think for you it's easier if I write the examples. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Let me think. Uh, uh, mm, 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 mm. Well, we have many examples here. I know. I put for whom so the other way is um, when you can say um, i uh, we have many friends i have many friends whom are girls teacher in the in the exercise uh, um, Says that fat men is the man for whom Max works. Mm -hmm. He works for but him. So he works for him, the fat man. So we use whom. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, it's not correct. He works for he works for he. 
She works for him. So that's when we use whom. So, um, do you do you do you know the what is active in in passive sentences? Like, hang yeah. on. Okay. So many times the whom receive the action, not do the action. Okay. Okay. So as an example. Um, here are many different examples, okay? I don't know, did everybody receive the examples? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, so in number one, he mm -hmm. saw the faces of those whom he loved at his birthday celebration. Okay. She saw a lady whom she presumed worked at the store. Now, if you look at all the sentences, is many times the man, like the last sentence, the man whom you met on Saturday is coming to dinner. Is because we use whom because the person received the action. You met the person. You did the action. The person received. This time we use whom. But if you need for whom I give more, I can send more in the WhatsApp and you can practice more. The whom, okay. the whom is, uh, if I remember correctly, is not part of the regular, is not necessary in the exam or in, in the class, in the platform. But it's important that you know exists another word like who. Okay. okay. This is the idea is to give you more information so that you understand that it's not only the three. It's okay. Okay. So in this moment, what we're going to do is now I'm going to send you everything okay, Anna? Okay. In this moment, I send you a link to practice the three ideas, the difference, who, which, and whose. Now, remember, why do we use who? Who for people, which for selection, for options, and whose for possession, for the owner. Okay. Okay? Every, every, everybody has the link? Yes. yes. Okay, perfect. Then what we're going to do is it's I'm going to, or, or is, is there another question? No. 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 Oh. Norma? No. No, okay. Okay, perfect. Then let's make some groups and, and some partners and we try to answer the questions with our partners. <clears throat> Hello. Hello, Mary. Hello. Teacher, I have a question. It's not this topic exactly, but it's in the other exercise. Color. Color, the, I, I, I have confused. I think that color is like in Spanish, but in the exercise is with you. Color. Uh, yes, there are two ways to write. There's always two ah, okay. forms always two forms to write the, the words. Usually there is a British form, which is with you, uh, and the American forms normally know you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Got it, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Daisy. 
is cool. 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 Oh, but The number two. A boy whose sister is in my class. What is the what is push? Okay, okay. Norma, give me give me a second. I have a a, a call. Norma, are you okay? Do you have any questions? I don't is the number two teacher is who? Correct. The, the correct. Whose is the correct because the the sister is for the boy, so is no who is whose because he is the owner is his sister. Okay. Okay. And Norma, what was number one? Uh, I think wish. This is the bank wish one mother yesterday. Correct, because it's with choices. That's right. Is which is for the things good. Good. Do, do you understand the idea, Norma? I difficult for me when it's good. Ah, okay, okay. Who but your explanation is clear, teacher. Okay. I, I, okay. Then you continue practicing with Raúl, and we check in a few okay. minutes. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. 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 Number three. Number three. Who wait? Who wait Waiting. outside in the car? Wait outside in the car. Yeah. Six. The woman who gave him the money was John. Who right? Who? Yeah. Who gave him? Seven. Seven the back. Uh, and the seven the back. Which? Which? The number eight. Who? Uh, the nine. Uh, I don't know, it could be who's. Gerardo, Jose, any questions? <clears throat> uh, no questions so far. I'm trying to to resolve the to exercises. Solve. Mm -hmm. To solve. Okay, okay. Okay, we'll check in a few moments then. Okay, good. Keep going. Okay. Here go. No, let me see. Teacher, yes. I got confused. Mm -hmm. When was no, no. a mm -hmm. was you use when re refer to the things? For and, what? And when you refer to the cosa or things. Mm -hmm. things. Yes, yes. And who is when you refer to the person or or, or people? And which is when you need to choose one election between many options. That is correct. But in the in that example, uh, we don't use any any which. For the ah, uh, then no, then you need to have there are some the, the number eight. Mm -hmm. We had a doubt because say the people. No, it's who. Mm -hmm. 
No, the people. No, 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 no. The people who. The people who who arrived. who were wow. in, who were in the bank. Mm -hmm. In the bank. What is fright frightened? Frightened is scared. Uh, frightened is uh, scared. Uh, mm -hmm. But there are many. Is there are. Is a, there a are. Man? Mm -hmm. Is who? Is who too? Yes. But don't mm -hmm. use any which. Mm -hmm. There are four sentences with which. Four. Miami. Yeah. And when check, we need to check. What is that? Yes, okay. check and check and learn. Yes, check and learn. That what you can see. What are the mistakes? No sé. No had an option to the check to the check. It. Yes, yes, yes. Have option yes. to check. Yes. In the bottom is. Let me see. And go to the, no. go up. Go up. Go to the right. There, uh huh, yes. <laughs> Go down, down, down. There, there, there. It says check answers. You see? Show all correct answers. Click. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. Click there. And now click check answers. And you will see that there are many sentences with which. This is the one which. That is the correct answers. You don't use it at choose. Is that correct answer? Mm -hmm. Wow. Because which is the option? Not all the banks were robbed. Only some a bank was robbed yesterday. Wow. Uh, I, I am who? Because I, I, I see when you need to choose between many options. No, 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 no. The, the, the which is only mm -hmm. for choose. Normally for small options. Here, uh, we ha here we have two options, rob or no rob. Ah, uh, can be implicit. Correct, correct, Norma. Okay, I understand better. Mm -hmm. But read the sentences and make sure you understand all the answers correct and not correct. That way you learn. Yes. Okay. Okay, and the and the last one is wash. A police officer was car was parking park it at the next mm -hmm. Hey, where's your partner? Uh she goes to the main session because we don't have more exercise. Ah, okay. Okay, then I close and we go and we talk in the main session. Okay, no problem. Okay, were there any questions? I think now we have a better understanding, but are there any questions, things that you understand? If you don't understand, it's not so clear. Teacher, I don't have clear. Whose? Whose? Okay, yeah. Gerardo. Whose? Um, let me give you, Gerardo, uh, uh, in your house, do you have a, uh, 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 a girlfriend, a wife, a mother. Uh, do do you live with other people? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Perfect. This is the this is the idea for whose. Ah. Okay. Okay. Here. Example. In my house. Hey. <laughs> we have this. This is a teddy bear. Okay. But I don't know the owner. I don't know the person that this is their teddy bear. So I don't say who teddy bear, I say whose teddy bear. Whose teddy bear? Because I want to know the owner of this teddy bear. I want to know which person this is the possession of. 
this is when we use whose when we when we want to know the owner example the cell phone gerardo in your house only one cell phone yeah you have cell phone and the other people have cell phone this is when you use whose you say the cell phone and you say ah whose cell phone do you want to know the owner of the cell phone Gerardo, do you know what is owner? Yes, the property. Yes, that's right, the that's property. property. That when you want to know the property, this is whose. Whose is for this? Mm. It's okay, Gerardo? Yes, it's more clear. Okay, good, good. Anybody else? Anybody have any other questions? Nope. No? Okay. Perfect. Excellent. Because now it's time for us to have our conversation. We're going to have, well, remember, in the last part of the class, the objective is to practice the fluency, the pronunciation, to use complete sentences, not only yes, no, 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 no. We want to make, explain, give details, information. Okay. It's okay? Yeah. Okay. So then, okay. So what we're going to do is I'm going to give you some questions. And with your partner, we're going to make sure that you understand the questions. First, I'm going to put in the chat and we read and make sure it's clear the question. That way, when you ask and talk with your partner, it's clear. It's like, like water, not like horchata. We want like water. <laughs> you understand the questions. <laughs> okay. Do you see the questions? What do you most like about? Okay. Okay. Very good. Norma, can you please read the questions? Okay, what do you most like about yourself? Mm -hmm. Continue. Uh, mm -hmm. I need to make the answer? Or no, only, that o only read the questions. Okay, what hurts your feelings? Uh, if you could be more be famous, would you want to? Why? Who is a celebrity? you admire what made you laugh at the school today <laughs> uh, did anything make you ups upset today if you could have more friends would you what do you like most about your friends is there anyone anyone at the school you like you know better. Have you ever lost a friend? Why? Okay. Everybody, do you understand the questions or do you want me to explain a vocabulary or a question or the pronunciation? <coughs> Gerardo, it's okay? Yes. Yes? Okay. Anna, was that okay? It's okay, Tisha. Okay. Thanks. Okay. So now in our groups, we want to practice speaking. Uh, Mary, what is the objective in the group? The, the what? What is the objective? Uh, it's, it's just uh, make a meet me. Who, who, what? Okay. And, and, and talk fluently. 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 Okay, good. Now remember, the objective is because this week, our objective was adverbs, adjectives, relative clauses. All of the topic is more information. Adjective, more information of the noun, the big book, the blue book. 
adverbs, more information of the verb. Uh, walk quickly. Mm -hmm. Walk quickly. Uh, eat slowly. That is the adverbs. And the relative clauses, more information in a statement. The, the class I like or the class which I like, not only the class like, no, this is the relative. So with our groups, with our partners, we are going to try to make complete sentences. Not only relative clauses, it's necessary you practice using all of the activities. The idea is, okay, some is one adjective, one adverb, and others is complete. Okay, everybody's ready? Right. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. Yeah, I were, I were, I were tired because I, I, I usually get sleep to the eleven or or twelve. Sour. But yesterday, sour. <laughs> yesterday, uh, were the eight, and I, I was, I was sleep, and mm -hmm. I, I, I didn't wake up. So, <laughs> I missed the the, the yesterday. So, let's do this. What do you most like about yourself? Mm. What do you do? Remember, here is adjectives because adjectives describe people. Adjectives describe okay. you. Uh, I like, I am happy. I am funny. I am nice. I am beautiful. But is okay. the... Remember for the week, adjectives, adverbs, relative clauses. But the three is for more information about the topic. Mm. Okay. okay. Well, I, I, what I like about me is that I'm a very... Um, Screaming... Uh, me grita. Ah, when the people scream me. Eh, como que las personas me griten. Ah, es, es, es. Scream is correct. Scream, scream me. Uh -huh. Scream. Only uh -huh. David, David is scream at me. At scream me. Okay. at me. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Okay. And you, Norma? In my case, when the people unrespected, would you want, would you want to? And why? Um, I would like to know the queen and Anna, what happened with your partner? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hmm. Lisette was your partner. I don't know what happened with Lisette. She okay, Anna, I'm going to... Yeah, she's not here. I don't know why. Okay, Anna, I'm going to put you in another group. In another group, it's okay? Okay. Okay, then I put you in another group.
would you want to write? If I could be famous uh, like you, I, I'd rather be an athlete uh, like Messi or, or something like that. Yeah, a, a soccer player, maybe, or it, it doesn't matter the what kind of sport. But if I could be famous, I I rather be an athlete. And it's possible a movie star or, or something like that. But I prefer be a, a, an athlete. Like an athlete. a rap, like a rap piece. <laughs> Maybe for <laughs> Jennifer Aniston it's okay. Okay. <laughs> Angelina Jolie. <laughs> and the the other question: Who is a celebrity you admire? Admire. I I don't have a particular celebrity. Uh, for a mile. Uh, <laughs> okay. I I hear you. <laughs> okay. Uh, in which uh, question? Uh, the number. Number four. Uh, who is a celebrity you admire? Ah, okay. Ah, okay. For. Uh, Teresa de Calcuta. And I love about my co working because a co working always see Cassie Serran. And it's funny when she explains what happened in this program. Okay. We have a new, a new, a new. The next Selena, one. Selena. Selena. Hi, Selena. Selena, do you, anything made you up to today? Selena is up here. <laughs> Selena. Hi. Selena, did you disappear, Selena? What happened? Mm, maybe Selena. Uh, uh huh. Maybe Selena is in the. Repeat, please. Selena. Yes, teacher. Can ah, okay. Repeat, no, no. Can you is can you hear? Okay. Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Let me let me make closer the microphone. Okay. And now, can is it better, Selena? Yes, it's better. Okay. The question, I, I think, uh, Daisy, what was the question? Who is the celebrity you admire? Or? No. Did anything make you upset today? The the, the audio. Uh -huh. Did anything make you upset today? Number six. No, excuse me. I don't hear you. Okay. Question number six. Did anything make you upset today? Okay. Okay, continue. Uh -huh. Norma? Um, I said about the traffic because I am late at work in this moment. Okay. And um, you me? Oh,
Okay, it is time for us to, almost time for us to finish. I just want to remind everyone that on Monday, we are going to begin section four next week, section four. This means you should have complete section one, two, and three. In section three, for Monday, it should be complete the homework and the midterm, okay? If it's not clear, watch again the videos, practice again. It's okay. If you have mistakes, you do again, and the computer allows you to correct the mistakes. Yes. Okay? So remember, for Monday, complete unit section one, two, and three. Some of you have still uh, a little bit of homework from this week from section three. But remember, do the midterm. Okay. 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 Have a great weekend. Relax, and I see you on Monday for the next class. But uh, <laughs> all right. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Good night. Bye.